Okay, they kept somebody tedious, by the way, but I, I do have to go to the whiteboard. There's no way I could fit the work here. And when I go to the whiteboard, I'll be rewriting the problem, and then I'll write down the first five terms. All right? So let's go to the whiteboard, and I'll write the problem down for you. And it's the fifth root of uh, a minus x. Well, I got a couple of problems. I need to write it as a power. That's one fifth. And I need to get that uh, first term to be one, so factor out an a, and that would be one minus x over a, and that's still to the one-fifth power, by the way. And I got additional problems, so let's write this over here. a to the one-fifth times one plus minus x over a to the one-fifth power. Now I can start expanding it. And what are you gonna get? a to the one-half times it's a lot of work, but we're going to put the work down now. It's going to be 1 plus 1 fifth minus x over a to the first power plus 1 fifth. And now it's going to be 1 minus 1 fifth. I'm sorry, 1 fifth minus 1. I'm sorry, I, sp I spoke that way. 1 fifth minus 1, which is minus 4 fifths. And what goes on bottom? 2 factorial, which is 2. And then what do you get? Minus x over a squared. All right, so I got three terms, and I got to keep going. And th this is always the issue for me. It's easy to write down, though. I'll say that. It's the arithmetic that kills me. Now, what do I notice about it? It's going down by 5, right? So 1 to minus 4 is down by 5, the numerator. So this would be minus 9 fifths. And this could be over 3 factorial, which is 6. Then you get minus x over a to the third power. Let's keep going. One-fifth minus four-fifths minus nine-fifths. And again, the new is going down by five. That's going to be minus 14-fifths over 24. And then you get minus x over a cubed. Now, depending on your teachers, they may say that's enough to do just that, that you're okay with that. Certainly, I don't, I don't think that's the best strategy, but certainly you wrote something down, and I do believe you should get credit for writing that down. But right now, I got to do it. And what do I get? I got um, A to the... You know what? I made a mistake over here, and I just noticed it. And I, the reason I notice things is they, they just look out of place. They don't look like they belong there. That shouldn't be a 2, by the way. It should be a, a 5. Sorry about that. I guess I got roots in my brain, square roots. All right, so let's write this down. It's gonna be a to the one-fifth, and I'm gonna go term by term now. So the first term is just one. The next term is minus x over five a. All right, I gotta do the next term, and before I do anything, I gotta get the sign. That's what I do first. That's definitely negative, all right? The next thing I'm gonna do is just the letter part of it. And what would I get there? x squared, and I would get a squared. Now i got to do the number. And I'll write it on the side for you. It's 1 fifth. And I already got the sign covered. 4 fifths, and there's a 2. 2 goes into 2 once, goes into 4 two times. So you get 2 over 25. Now, again, as I always say, mistakes happen. If they do happen, we're going to know it by looking at the key, by the way. All right, so i got three terms. Fourth term in. Let's do the sign of it. Clearly going to be negative. Let me make sure that's true. Yeah, negative. All right, I'm going to put the letter down first because it's easy. That's x cubed, a cubed. And now I'm going to do the number. So what do you get? You get 4 times 9. And you get 5, 5, 5. And you're dividing by 6. Well, 3 goes into 6 2 times. 3 goes into 9 3 times. 2 goes into 2 once and it goes into four two, uh, two times. So you get six on top, and what do you have on bottom? 125. All right, let's keep going. Let me get my eraser out, get rid of my baby arithmetic. But if you can do that in your head, good for you. I can't do that in my head, by the way. Or if I do, I generally make mistakes. Let's do that last term. All right, let's do the sign. And you know what? Let me see if I got this, one, two, three. I notice there's something wrong with this one, too. That should be a 4. And what do you get there? Could be minus. 
and let me write down um, my letters, X4, A4. Also have to look at my clock, make sure I'm not running into late time. No, I'm doing all right. And I gotta do that number, it's a killer, it really is. Let's write this down. It's gonna be four, nine, 14. By the way, I do not, I'm not opposed to using a calculator, but I see five times five times five times five, that's 625. And then I got the 24. Well, I'm gonna do it by three first. Ah, let's do it by four. Four goes into four once, goes into 24 six times. Let's see, three goes into six twice, and it goes into nine three times. Two goes into two once, it goes into 14 seven times. So we left off with 21, and on the bottom you left with 625. Does this go on? Yes, it does. I'll just put plus dot, dot, dot. I'm not saying the next term is a positive term, I'm just simply saying there's a bunch of things I'm not adding on. So let's multiply this through, a to the 1 fifth, minus x, 5a to the 4 fifths, minus 2x squared, 25a. Well, that's going to be, what, 10 fifths minus 1 fifths, 9 fifths. Minus 6x cubed, 125, 15 minus 1, 14 fifths. These also have a nice pattern, by the way. Minus 21x4. And then you get 625. And then you're going to get A. Let's just talk about the pattern. I'm looking at the, the power of the A. I forgot to put the A down. 4 fifths, 9 fifths, 14 fifths. That looks like it's going up by 5, so 21 fifths. All right, and this goes on. Let's get my little red pen out. And we're looking at the answer key. And what number is this? Number four, right? I notice I wrote in radical notation. I'm not going to bother, by the way. A to the one-fifth minus x, 5a to the four-fifths minus 2x squared, 25a to the nine-fifths minus 6x cubed, 125a to the 14 fifths, minus 21x4, I'm just looking at my key by the way, 625, whoops, I made a mistake. I said 21 fifths. Now remember what I said, it's going up by five. So four to nine is up by five. I'm looking at the, the powers. I'm gonna put what I mean by that. The numerators are going up by five. Remember I said that? So four to, to up nine, five, nine to 14, five up. And then it said 21. I don't know why it said 21, but that's not up by 5. What should it be? 19. Let me get my eraser out, and I'll put that down. I'll correct that. All right? Get the red pen out again. Do I get it? 19 fifths. All right? By the way, I know I wrote more terms than that down, but they just asked for 5. I'm just delivering 5. Thank you.